Europeans. Great speed underneath the bar. Fully committed all the way there. That's the perfect example of power, combination of speed and strength. Just what he needed, going back into top position. Now let's take a look at uh, Cherovic. Again with a PB of uh, 134. Now uh, Cherovic here, he's gone 128, 131. Now hoping to lift 135. Uh, Stanislaw Tradovic for Belarus not only a PB but will go into top position if this is a successful lift well a little soft in the receiving position but my goodness is he strong gets the three white dots all clear from the jury and referees and uh, Tradovic goes into top position and what a way to take the lead with a personal best Superb lifting, great extension, didn't sit back on it, which is good. Bar moves very close to the body. <laughs> See the coach is trying to lift it with him. So back to the Bulgarian, this is Filev, Ivelo Filev. 133, successful in his first lift. Now raises it by three kilos to take it to 136 to go into top position. This is only his second lift. That game plan of putting in the highest weight for his first lift has given him the opportunity to watch the rest of Europe's best. This to take the lead back for Bulgaria. A little short on the extension. As a result, caught it in front, had to take a step forwards to steady himself. But another solid lift. And he gets the all clear and a new leader. Setting the mark now at 136 kilograms. He's getting closer to his PB of 138. He may need to lift 138 to secure top position in the snatch division here. But this is brilliant work from the Bulgarian. He hasn't put anything, done anything wrong so far. No, and he's a tall lifter, but. If you look at the proportions, he's got a long back, short arms and legs. That's ideal leverage for a, a good weightlifter. Well, confirming the form of the World Championships of last year, where the Bulgarian uh, Filev took the bronze. Looking to add a European title here in Israel today to that impressive performance of last year. 26-year-old Bulgarian still with one more lift to go. This is the man that he's up against. Bunyami Cesar from Turkey. Now, interesting to note that uh, Cesar is going for 137, just one kilo higher than the Bulgarian had just lifted. And uh, most importantly, with a PB of 142, the 2012 European champion has got to make this count to put the pressure on the Bulgarian. Guaranteed a medal, but this is for gold. No lift for Bunyami Cesar. He'll have to keep the 135 and the silver medal position. Now there is one lift left for Filev Mikhaila. This is let's talk us through where it went wrong. Uh, from my, my opinion, he bent his arms way too early there. As soon as the arms come in, the legs cannot be fully effective. He lost uh, a couple of inches there trying to get the bar overhead. That's a shame. So, Filev has done enough with his 136 to take the individual gold of the snatch, but now he's looking to successfully lift 137 to put himself in an even stronger position going into part two, the clean and jug. Yeah, no time co for complacency here, while he has the largest starting weight for the clean and jerk. You never know what the other lifters are going to do. They could increase it at the last minute, so every kilo is important. He's already taken the gold in the snatch, but this is...
part of his game plan to take clean and jerk gold and the overall European title in this weight division. Oh, it's not there. Well, that keeps this competition well and truly alive. But congratulations to Philev. And no lift in his third and final attempt and looking to try and lift 137, but he still takes the individual gold. Yeah, just yanked that a bit as it came off the floor, pulled him onto his toes. That was a lift that was lost before the bar even got to his knees. What a shame. So confirmation that uh, Filev takes gold for Bulgaria, silver for Cesar of Turkey, Belarus's Chadovic takes the bronze. Quick break for us. We'll be back with more after the message.